All across Oklahoma, communities are investing in the future of children's safety by building brand new tornado shelters like this one here and more. And that means kids now are safer more than ever before. 141 out of 345 schools in the metro now have FEMA rated safe rooms with 36 more planned over the next two years. One of the reasons for the increase is the response to the May 20th, 2013 more tornado. I think most definitely the more tornado was probably a turning point uh, for a lot of us. The impact is happening outside the metro too though. Oak City Superintendent Rick Harrison has no doubt that students there are more safe. When y'all put out an alert. And then get into your shelter right now. I am very concerned for the community. That we know, hey, there's that there's 820 kids that's going to be safe. And it's not just the students who have peace of mind. You know, teachers love their kids. I think people don't understand that they treat their, their those kids in that classroom are their kids and they love them and, and want to keep them out of harm's way. And Woodward Superintendent Kyle Reynolds agrees. I tell you what, it feels great knowing that we have somewhere for all of our students to go. And the students can get there in a hurry. Our recent tornado drills, we can accomplish that in a matter of somewhere around three minutes. The nighttime Woodward tornado in April 2012 was an eye-opener. We went to what we had always thought was our safe place, which was the dressing rooms and the basketball gym. And we had some studies conducted and found out that that's really not a very safe place to be. Woodward responded, and momentum is building as other communities invest in shelters too. It's money well spent to have that reassurance and we know in Oklahoma that that can happen. While tornadoes are a part of life here in Oklahoma, it's encouraging to see more and more shelters getting built and that means our kids are safer. In more, Field Meteorologist Michael Armstrong, KOCO 5 News.